Well, breaking news this noon, a 16 year old is now charged as an adult with the murder of a 14 year old Raleigh girl. We're talking about Makia Daniel, the eighth grader at Ligon Middle School, who was shot and killed in a Raleigh apartment back in <laughs> April. WRL's Chelsea Donovan has been covering this story since that tragic day. And Chelsea, you just went through dozens of unsealed search warrants. What were you able to learn from them? <laughs> Yeah, so let's set the scene here. It was uh, here at these apartments on North Hills Drive back in April, where in a back bedroom, police found 14-year-old Makia Daniel with a gunshot wound to the head. And we are learning more from these newly unsealed search warrants that her family actually called the police for a welfare check here based on just some disturbing messages that she was dead that they received from the social media app Instagram. Now, this was the scene in April of this year when police arrived here on North Hills Drive. Search warrants just unsealed yesterday are revealing what may have led to the eighth grader's death. One warrant indicates that several of Makia's friends believe she was killed after getting into a fight at school five days prior. Now, those warrants detail that several subjects meant to scare Makia and not kill her. Now, warrants show a 16-year-old Zylon Abrams sent a message to Makia's aunt after she was killed that read, and I'm paraphrasing here. I'm sorry for real. I'm turning myself in. I love her and mean none of this to happen. I'm sorry. I wanted to say I'm sorry. Now, moments ago, as you just mentioned, uh, we did learn that 16-year-old's name, Zylon Abrams, and we understand from the district attorney that he was indicted in her death in May, and he will be tried as an adult. Live in Raleigh, Chelsea Donovan, WREL News.